So, today we'll be investigating the reaction between hydrogen and oxygen. Now firstly, I've got some um, one mole per litre hydrochloric acid here, and also I've got uh, some magnesium strips. So when a metal reacts with an acid, hydrogen gas is produced, and since that is less dense than air, it can be collected in an inverted boiling tube. Now you can see that a chemical reaction is occurring here. Firstly, bubbles are being formed, which indicates uh, the creation of a gas. Also, heat is being released. So. so, that was a loud pop that you heard, and that is the test for hydrogen. Now, as you can see here, there's a little bit of water vapour. And clearly, the hydrogen gas has uh, reacted with the oxygen in the air to produce water. We could have inserted a piece of cobalt chloride paper into the mouth of the test tube to test for water. A positive result would be that the paper turns pink. That would confirm the presence of water. However, if the paper stays blue, that would be a negative result and would show that water was not present. The test for hydrogen that we used was to insert a lighted splint into the mouth of the test tube. It showed a positive result, the splint extinguishes, with a high-pitched pop sound. However, if there was no sound, then that would show that there was a negative result, and that no hydrogen was present. The word equation for this reaction is hydrogen reacts with oxygen to yield water. The balance symbol equation informs us that two moles of diatomic hydrogen will react with one mole of diatomic oxygen to yield two moles of water.